Laundry. His parents are changing their story. The attorney for the Laundry family now says the parents last saw Brian September 13th, one day earlier than what they told investigators originally. Our own Ileana Diaz live with details on this new revelation. Ileana, why the change? Well, Adrian, the attorney says that the parents were remembering the last time they saw Brian according to a series of events and Apparently, they were a day off and we're just learning about this now. But the search for their son, Brian Laundrie, continues and we're learning more about his whereabouts and the timeline. Now, we do know that he was last seen by his parents on September 13th, not the 14th, which is what they originally said. That's an extra day that Brian Laundrie is unaccounted for. And now the focus is his timeline. Brian flew back home to Florida without Gabby on August 17th, and then he returned to join Gabby in Salt Lake City on August 23rd. The family attorney says that Brian briefly returned to Florida to get some items and to empty out a storage unit. Now, Brian Laundrie's sister, Cassie, says she saw her brother on that trip, and then she saw him again for the last time at a campground on September 6th. I worry about him. I hope he's okay. And then I'm angry and I don't know what to think. I would tell my brother to just come forward and get us out of this horrible mess. I don't know if my parents are involved. I think if they are, then they should come clean. Now, Cassie says that she has not seen her parents since her brother went missing and that they're also ignoring her calls when she tries to reach out to them. Gabby Petito's mother and father have also been vocal and are asking the family, the Laundry family, to come forward and share any details that they may know. We're going to have more about that story coming up in the next hour, Adrian. Eliana, very, very many uh, tangled webs in this story. Thank you so much.